guys my name is caprice um this is just a youtube video i'm doing because when i was searching for semi-permanent hair dyes um i didn't see much videos on it um so today i'm gonna make a video of me just trying it out i've never dyed my hair before so with with even like a uh, semi-permanent dye so this is the first time i'm putting any color in my hair so my hair is jet black and I have a lot of hair. I bought two bottles of the Honey Brown semi-permanent hair dye. I'm gonna use both. I'm gonna see if it works and uh, I'll let you guys know. Okay, so first of all, I need to wash my hair. That's a part of the instructions and towel dry. So I'm gonna do that right now. And then after that, I'm gonna let you guys watch the process of me putting in the dye. I just finished washing my hair and towel drying it so um we can get started okay guys so the instruction says to shampoo and towel dry which i did to use protective cream around the hairline i don't have any so i'll just use petroleum jelly i don't know what you guys have what's the right thing to do you just do that this is what i'm doing and apply the color one eighth of an inch from the scalp and to comb through thoroughly my hair is not detangled i have to detangle it and to cover it with a plastic plastic cap and process with heat for up to 15 minutes so i have a hooded dryer i'm gonna just sit under that like medium low heat whatever i feel comfortable with and let it just uh, sink in and then after that it says to rinse and shampoo completely so just so you know i'm using honey brown 48 let's see how it works so i have two plastic caps with me because i have a lot of hair and um, my head is big so it's not gonna fit in one cap i have my white tooth comb i just found two gloves i'm just gonna use it i bought this from dollar tree i didn't want to use any of my dishes and two bottles so oh and clips i have my clips i couldn't find all of these so i just found whatever you use whatever so what I'm going to do is I'm going to detangle my hair. So I've detangled my hair. As you can see, it's all detangled. And I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to section it because I'm not so sure two bottles will be enough, but uh, we'll see. I'm going to section it in about four. I'm going to put three up and then I'm going to work with one. So well, let me do that right now. this section first um it's pretty much detangled but my hair is very dry yep it's pretty much detangled i have an old towel i'm gonna put on the floor to protect it uh i don't want to make a big mess so that's there I'm gonna pour this out in my little container. Make 
my handshakes, but that's the uh, color of it. It's black. I hope one can do it. One should be able to do it, hopefully. I have really dark hair, so I'm gonna be putting a lot on there. It says you can process the hair with heat up to 15 minutes. I did about six, seven-ish minutes because I was spinning it so long. I already, you know, time already passed that it was in my hair. So I'm gonna wash it out and I'll let you guys know how it looks. But right now, I'm gonna take it off. Uh, um, I mean, the dye is still in there, so it's still dark, but it's covered most of my hair as you can see. So I'm gonna go ahead and rinse it out right now. I'm gonna use a little shampoo and some conditioner because my hair is very dry. Uh, although it's not a part of the instructions, you do what you want, but for me, I'm gonna go ahead excuse me, and um, yeah, I'll put some conditioner in there also. So it's done, I rinsed it out and everything. It's a little dry because I was cleaning up after my mess. Um, so, my hair is defined. <laughs> I think it's a little defined. I see like a hue. It's not as dark as it usually is. Like a hue of brown on my hair. I mean, I can't expect much from a semi-permanent uh, hair dye on my jet black hair. But, um, I'm going to see when it's fully dry how it comes out and then I'll update you guys let you guys know but right now this is this is it it's still black <laughs>